Hey everyone, my name is Kevin Taka. Thanks for watching this video. I'm a full-time artist and I'm, today I'm going to teach you guys how to draw a, a human eye schematically correct. Now, a lot of times when you try to draw a human eye, people, you know, you ask someone to draw a human eye, they will say, I don't want to draw, you know, so difficult. No, it is as, it is simple. But there's one thing I need to point out is now why do we sometimes draw things it doesn't look like what we desire, what we want is because there's only one thing we need to get it correct is the, the proportion, right? So let's get on with it. So guys, drawing human eye, is it easy? Of course it is easy. Let me show you how it's done. Now, a lot of times when we try to draw human eye, we always tend to make uh, pretty, a lot of mistakes by including the wrong curvature. Now what I mean curvature is sometimes when they draw human eye, th this is the curvature we are talking about. You see, it's totally out of proportion. So it looks kind of weird and it's just not, it doesn't look right. So today the easiest way to identify that is, first thing all you have to do is, you have to give you a nice, uh, draw yourself a nice little circle and the one on the inside works as a pupil and then on one more right in the middle. That is gonna be the reflection the, uh, from the light. Now. The next two things you have to do is you have to put draw just draw two curvature line across your eyes like this. You see? Now remember the previous circle in there? All you have to do is to get rid of the uh, the top one, right? And the bottom one. Now that you leave yourself a nice little proportionate curvature on your eyes. Okay guys? So guys, here's a tip. Before we go, there's a, this three tips I need. I want to share with you guys, and I hope you guys can remember for the rest of your life. Now, this is very important, is because when you draw something, you have to incorporate these three things, three things into your artwork. Number one is the shape. We're talking about the shape. It doesn't matter what you're gonna draw, a box or whatever, whatsoever. And the second thing is the shadow. And finally, but not least, it's gonna. This one is a bit slightly difficult, but of course. You learn, you know, as you practice every day. It's called the D, the details. Now, if you incorporate all these three into any piece of your artwork, it's going to look beautiful. Right, guys? So thanks for watching this video. I'll see you guys in the next chapter. Bye for now.